Hello guys, welcome back to another Blender tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about how to do robotic camera animations. So, I will show you an example here. So, this is what we are going to make in this video. So, let's start. So, first of all, I'm deleting this camera. Okay. Now, ship A. I'm adding a camera. A camera is all there. So I need to snap it over here for that. Control Alt Numpad 0 and Shift F. Uh, so if your work navigation is not working, you can go here in view navigation and on the down corner there is option work navigation. So now it's assigned to Shift F shortcut. In here, instead of change, change shortcut, it will be a send shortcut or something like that. So you can change the shortcut, keep it as Shift F only because most of the Blender users use this as Shift F. So when you watch other tutorials and stuff, it will be easy for you to follow. So use Shift F and that's it. So let's go to first frame, select our camera, don't forget that, and click I and location rotation so i gave a keyframe here and i'm going to 45th frame then i'm clicking our previous keyframe which i gave and duplicating it shift d and dragging it into 45th frame nice after that if you click your right arrow button you can jump from frame to frame so i'm going to do 15th frame then going to click shift F okay cool okay this time I'm concentrating on the tire okay I'm going to keep my angle here and click I and location rotation and keep in mind that always keep your camera selector either from here or from here Okay, again I'm selecting my last frame and duplicating it. Shift D and going into 95th frame. So I'm keeping it there and I'm going to the 100th frame. And again I'm changing my view. This time let's showcase the logo or the name of this car. Dots. Nice. Click I. Location rotation so nice after that again i'm doing the same pattern selecting the last keyframe which i gave duplicating it dragging it till 45 frames then going to 115th frame shift f let's kill this angle nice i location rotation again selecting the last frame going into 190 file Close. now go to 200 frames again say here in here there is another logo let's portray that from this angle nice i location rotation again select your last frame go to 245 and go to your last frame in that show this car completely over here mm -hmm. yeah nice I location rotation so let's preview our animation wow 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 nice I know it's bad so Select our all keyframes and before that go here, drag here and make a new frame. Let's uncheck this, 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 and this. Okay. And go here and change 3D viewport into graph editor. So if you look at here, oh yeah. Uh, in our graph editor, our graphs are ready to be tweaked. 
but I'm not going to do that. So I'm not going to do anything manually. In here, I'm going to do select all keyframes, go to key density and bake keyframes. So now you can see our timeline is filled with a lots of keyframes. Perfect. So when we smooth it, it will be nice. Then go to key smooth smooth legacy so you can see it's started had to give a small slice slope over here now let's go and click out s so you will get option this and click this is a shortcut for the smoothing okay click smooth legacy and keep clicking art oh 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 until you are satisfied with the code okay now let's check our animation so that's it that so that's it our video so i hope you like this animation and uh, i hope you understand my English. Hmm. Anyway, see you in another tutorial. Bye-bye.